welcome back to Make Mark Studios. Today I'm going to be showing you how to create a digital grid to use for an artwork. Uh, this is awesome because it saves you a lot of printer ink and paper. Um, so we're going to show two methods. Uh, one is using a Mac and method two is using Google Slides. So let's start with method one, which is using a Mac to create your digital grid. First, you'll want to scroll down to the link below and check out my blog post on how to make a digital grid. Um, in this post, you'll see that I have an art grid conversion chart that'll show your photo size, art paper size, and how to set up your grid on your blank sheet of art paper or canvas. Um, this is just suggested. It's, it's for anyone that might need it. All right, scrolling down a little, you're going to see some PNG files. PNGs are going to be transparent, allowing you to copy onto images and still see the image behind it. So pick the one you want and right click, save image as. All right, now on your Mac, you want to open the transparent grid that you downloaded and the image you're going to select the grid first and we're going to go to edit drop down and select all and then edit drop down and copy then you're going to go to your image that you want to put the grid on and go to edit paste you can resize your grid to fit on your image you'll notice here I have a little excess space um, that I don't want and so I'm going to use the marquee and select the image with the grid, position everything how I'd like, and go to tools and crop. Now keep in mind, Mac will auto save this image with the grid on it. Next method is using Google Slides. I love Google. Um, on my blog post, you'll see I have a link to access the Google Slide grids. So when you click on that, you're going to see all the different choices, the no math grid and the transparent grid. So when you open up the slide, uh, it won't allow you to edit. So you're going to have to click file and make a copy. You'll want to save this onto your personal Google Drive. And this step is so easy. Um, once you have your copy slide, you're going to go to File, sorry, Insert, Image, Upload from the computer, find the image you want to add in. And this is like magic. You're going to right click and order and send it to the back. You'll see now that your grid is on top. File, Download can get you a JPEG copy of that image. Um, I love this method. It's awesome. I hope you found this video tutorial to be helpful. Feel free to subscribe for more videos from Make a Mark Studios, helping you to make your mark through art.